Now it seems Ashok Gehlot is not out of the race for Congress president yet even though the Gandhis are upset with the rebellion by more than 90 Rajasthan MLAs loyal to him some of them could now in fact face disciplinary action however it seems Digvijay Singh and Malikarjun Kharge could also be in the running for the Congress job one it seems there aren't too many takers for but Harsha Kumari Singh joining us at this point with the latest developments in uh, Rajasthan, which has been going through crisis really. Harsha, what's happening? Well, as of now, uh, you know, Ashok Gehloth in the evening had a very relaxed meeting with some MLAs who had gone to meet him. They just dropped in to say hello and you know, uh, ask him, uh, uh, you know, what was happening. Uh, so the sense that we got is that Ashok Gehloth is actually very relaxed, body language is very relaxed. But what we do know from sources, and let me tell you, uh, uh, you know, there are as many sources in the uh, Congress as there are stories. So it's quite a task to, uh, you know, unravel the threads. But having said that, um, we do know that senior leaders of Congress uh, uh, um, uh, CM Ashok Gehlot's vintage are reaching out to him. Ambika Soni is going to be speaking to him. We've been told that perhaps even uh, Kamal Nath or Digvijay Singh could also reach out to him. Anand Sharma. These are the names that are doing the rounds. So that means the you know the high command is not really put him into the deep freeze, so to speak. Also, the MLAs, their tone is much more conciliatory now. Uh, uh, Pratap Singh Khachariyawas had a press conference today in Jaipur where he said, uh, Sonia Gandhi, hamari ma hai, and we will do whatever Sonia Gandhi says. Uh, Shanti Dhariwal also, uh, in his own way, said that, you know, it's up to the party high command. We will do what they say. But they are at pains to say that the entire narrative, they are at pains to emphasize that their voices should also be heard. Also, they... Uh, did launch a frontal attack on Mr. Ajay Makan, who, uh, you know, was one of the central party observers, and they said he was canvassing for a certain candidate. They were not happy with that. But at the same time, uh, you know, a disciplinary action has been recommended, and it's been recommended against three people who are closest to Ashok Gehloth. Uh, one is Mr. Shanti Dhariwal, at whose residence the MLA is gathered. The other person is Chief Whip Mahesh Joshi. And the third person is Mr. Dharmendra Rathor, who, interestingly, is not an MLA. Uh, he's a political appointee. He's the chairperson of the Rajasthan Tourism Development Corporation, but he's considered very close to Mr. Ashok Gehloth. Uh, so while uh, Ashok Gehloth apparently... Uh, has, uh, uh, you know, uh, his name has not figured in that. I mean, he, Mr. Gehloth has also been at pains to say that he did not know that the MLAs were doing that and so has have his MLAs emphasized that. So no, nothing against Mr. Gehloth. In fact, there's an olive branch uh, being reached out to him, but at the same time, disciplinary action uh, against those people close to him. Right. Hacha, thanks so much for joining us uh, with all of those details.